Mikhail Mack, who led away from pole position at the start of the seventh race of the season alongside Lance Diarnold and Giovanni Venturini as they headed towards Turn 1. It was really those three cars that gave us the story of the afternoon. It was a lightning getaway from Duncan Tappy for the Garage 59 McLaren up into fourth position. They're all cleanly through in the opening stages as one of the stories of the first half of the race was the formidable progress of Marco Ciocci from the very back of the grid. Ciocci hustling his way past Vitantone Liuzzi eventually up to about eighth place by the time the pit stops happened. Post pit stops though, it all went wrong for the number eight Ferrari, Ferrari attack between Cobb Ledegar and here Giuseppe Perazzini rotating. Perazzini Ledegar thereafter was an absolute charge and eventually finished in 12th overall. In front of the field though, Miguel Ramos was leading the way as behind Thomas Jaeger was flying in the Lechner Racing Mercedes. As was Vito Postiglioni in the second Imperial Early Racing Lamborghini. But this then decides to make the race as Miguel Ramos tagged Johnny Molem as he was putting a lap on the FF course for Ferrari. That promoted Valentin Pierberg into the lead of the race. With a slight error into turn one from Pierberg, gave the opening for Thomas Biaggi, who was able to side his way past. And so it was Thomas Biaggi and Giovanni Venturini who scored their first victory of the season. Second place going to Valentin Pierberg and Lance Diarnold and Miguel Ramos and Mikel Mack completing the outright race podium.